bro, imagine selling meth. I mean, that's like, like, you know that's bad for you, right? Like, who the fuck wants people to be doing meth? If you're selling meth, you're, you're profiting off of terrible decision making, right? Agreed? I've heard a couple of people have good, some good math stories. Really? I have. Well, one they of get, our friends. They get one good, of our friends. Good stories when the story's <laughs> o- when the night is over. I, we have a friend. I won't, I won't say his name here, and I'll, and I'll never say it. Okay. <laughs> and we were, all, we were all about to hang out. Can and I was, guess? Can I guess who yeah. it is? Okay. Okay, yeah. And if you guess it right, I'll, okay. I'll, I'll tell you. Okay. We were all hanging out. We were all about to go hang out again. And he was telling me and Joey, okay, it's not Joey Diaz. <laughs> he was telling me and Joey Diaz a story about this chick. And he was like, I can't even say. <laughs> okay, let's not. You're going to get somebody in trouble, aren't yeah, you? And, yeah. But no, this is a long time ago. This is like fucking 12 years ago. I understand. And he was like, I did meth last night. <laughs> And Joey's like, what the fuck? He goes, I know. I was trying to fuck this chick. And she like, pulled out meth. And, you, oh and he was God. like, he was like, ah, you know. <laughs> wow, that's right. I remember that story. You know who it is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, remember that yeah. story. Oh my God, I forgot about that. Yeah. Yeah, that's a that's a wild decision to make. <laughs> if you're well, alone with a person you just met who wants to do meth with you. <laughs> How how all in on this life experience are you? <laughs> Joey goes, did you fuck her? And he goes, we did meth, Joey. We definitely fucked Oh, my God. <laughs> but don't they say that Adderall is, like, very similar chemically? It's very similar. Oh, it's very, dude. It's like it's a type of amphetamine, right? So if you went bonkers <laughs> with Adderall, if you had some dude who could just give you all the Adderall you need, like some homie that works at the Adderall factory and, he's, and he sells you a barrel of these fucking things. If you just chewed them all day long, like you would just be like a person doing meth, right? Well, I, if I'm not mistaken, and I apologize if this comes out weird, but I think that's what Mulaney said in his special was that Adderall was one of his problems too. Yeah, I think Adderall, yeah, yeah, Adderall is, I mean, I've done both. I've done Adderall, I've done Ritalin, and I've done Coke. Coke is way more fun than the other two, but the way the other two I actually enjoy more. Like it's, like you, if you take an Adderall, you just your di- your diet. You don't want to eat. You feel fuck. You could you have the focus to to skin a grape. I mean, Whoa. you could fucking focus. Damn, uh, dude. Making it sound exciting. Adderall's <laughs> the shit. You. I remember taking. I remember taking an Adderall and just sitting down and writing a script and back, just being like, boom. Back in the day, um, all the top pool players would take amphetamines. Darts, same, same, bro. You f- darts, same thing. Same darts yeah. is like a big fucking speed place. I shouldn't say all the top pool players, but uh, in all honesty, a lot of them. And like, I shouldn't say darts because I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. This was a long ass time ago, like in the seventies and shit. There's uh, there's some great books that were written about those days. But these guys would play for 24 hours, 48 hours. They'd really? stay up for days just taking pills and gambling until one went ro- one one guy goes broke or one guy quits. They didn't yeah. want people quitting on anybody. So the, the thing is, like, if you're up ahead, so, like, if you and I were gambling and you're ahead of me and you are you're you have all of my money and, you, you, and I want to keep gambling until I'm completely broke, you're, like, obliged to drain the person. You're obliged to like to carry it out to the bitter end because really? maybe that guy might claw his way back. And then 18 hours later, now you're breaking even. Like, oh my God, but he wants to keep playing. So you got to go in the bathroom and take pills and you come out you're oh all like, fucking jacked up with huge pupils. And you're just gambling for days like that. There was a lot of those guys. I, I uh... Wild fellas. Wild human beings, man. They deliver, man. Those pills and coke, they deliver. 